first things first you've got your Akai MPD 218 and uh, this video I'm gonna show you how to set things up so that you can play your virtual instrument notes set up custom scales um, etc okay so first thing you want to do is to head over to the Akai website okay for the 218 all right so that's www.akaipro.com forward slash mpd218 once you're here scroll down a bit and hit that down hit the downloads tab right so depending on what platform you're on you're going to want to choose either of this okay i'm on a mac so that's the one i downloaded i downloaded the one for the mac all right now i've already downloaded it and set things up so you would have to go through the same process okay now once you've done that, you fire it up, file, new. Okay. The first thing you're going to notice is that the MIDI channel by default is set to MIDI channel 10. And that's because, you know, from back in the days, MIDI channel 10 has always been set up for playing drums. So the default uh, setting of the uh, MPD-218 is to play drums. Okay. So what you're going to need to do is to set all the drum pads to MIDI channel 1 okay now you can do it one by one by you know clicking on the pad and then changing it to MIDI channel 1 but that's a bit cumbersome okay but there's a great tool for bulk editing them so you hit the tools um, auto populate and this window pops up now you'd notice that you could select that for example and it's already set to one and apply it across all banks in one go so apply and that's all done okay so we have to go start now so pretty much if you sent this to the hardware um, you'll be able to play your virtual instruments no problem chromatically okay as you can see C, C sharp, D, D sharp etc and it goes on right now this is pretty cool okay and um yeah but you can also do other stuff too like uh set custom scales so for example um you know i probably want to use this for example the phrygian scale just to be all the different um i set that up and you can also set the root key so you get map or set up all your custom scales with all different root keys so for example I've got like an instrument which is uh, tuned uh, to the key of B it's, it's a native flute okay so if I was gonna you know make music with that I'd have this just set to the key of B the root key of B uh, so that every time I fire this a uh, preset up I'm good to go with my Phrygian scale and uh, root key of B. So if I did that, apply that, you notice that's all changed, okay? Which is great. Um, so you could experiment with other stuff and uh, see, you know, just um, customize things to your liking, okay? Once you're done, once you're done, you want to save this, okay? And uh, I'll tell you why in a minute. So let's say we save this as. Uh, I say just key of B, key of B. Uh, put that on my desktop. All right, bang. All right, so that's there, and I say key of B. All right, so now you could send that or all the other custom presets you made up to sixteen to the hardware machine. Okay, just hit send. For example, in slot one, I've already save this one I load that bang and you could go across doing them for all of them okay and this is pretty cool um all in all all in all I am really digging the uh, Akai MPD 218 no frills not too much going on everything is just simple in your face knobs right there no big screen with all fancy stuff just got your pads you got your knobs and um, I like the fact that you could customize it according to your taste. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you found this video helpful. If it is, you know what to do. Hit that like button, subscribe, 
You know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. Until we see you in the next video, stay blessed and peace be with you.